Well, Punk, you lost your match at SummerSlam. So, how do you feel? How do I feel? Hmm. Oh, what's the right word? Oh, yeah. I'm annoyed. I'm disappointed. I mean, we had a great match. Me, Rusev, Joe, great match. But I'm disappointed I didn't get the belt back. I mean, I mean Joe was a great athlete. I mean, no one can deny that. But it would have been nice to get the belt back. Overall, I'm doing okay-ish. I mean, I know we've been kind of... We're not as fast as we could be when it comes to the writing process. I mean, writing process takes a long time. I mean, if it's not much of a problem, then it won't take long. But if it is, then it does take long. You know, blah, 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 blah. Just shut up already. Hello. Rollins, how are you? How am I? I'm a not good idiot. As y'all don't know, I lost my world title to Cody Rhodes. Okay, I lost it. I had it for six months. That was my title. I made that title mean something. And the fact that someone like Cody Rhodes... Beat me, and then he lost. Then he lost to Sami Zayn. Like all the prestige that belt had has been evaporated because of the hot shining. Well, I mean that's just too bad. Too bad you're just whining about it instead of moving on. Oh yeah, because you didn't care about your title. No, I cared about my title. When you beat Jeff Hardy. For the WWE title. Sure it got the biggest buy rate in company history. But. Did anyone care afterwards? No they didn't. Okay. Everyone cared about me. Okay. Because I am Seth Rollins. And I'm the best. I'm the best wrestler. I'm the best talker. I should be Universal Champion. I shouldn't be Roman Reigns' lackey. Blah 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 blah. Okay. Look I get it. You're super talented. You deserve a lot better than what you're getting. I get it. However, whining is going to get you nowhere, Seth. Alright, trust me. I've seen people whine and whine all day long. You want to know where it got them? Nowhere. It got them de-pushed. It got them fired. And it got them broke. Alright, do you want that to happen to you? I mean, look who's talking about whining you whined about wwe being all so dangerous so uh unprofessional vince being so unprofessional and then you quit and then look what happened your relationship with cole cabana look how that friendship ended and, it, and the two of you are basically enemies at this point hey don't bring colt into this don't bring that into this okay these people we do not need this on the show well i brought it up what are you going to do about it? You're going to slap me in the face? Because we all know you can't punch like a man. <laughs> That's really funny. Real funny. You know, you have some jokes. But, um... But I think I heard that you were crying. Yeah, you were, you were crying when you lost the title. You cried. You cried with your little girlfriend, uh, Sasha Banks. And when she lost... Uh, her title. So you two were just a bunch of a crying couple. That's all you got. These were. Oh, so you're just gonna bring my girlfriend into this? Yeah, I mean you brought Cole Cabana into this. Then I might as well bring Sasha Banks into this. I mean, what's the problem there, gentlemen? Now can, let's let's just talk about this for a little bit. Shut up, Regal. You know, Punk. I'm sick of your attitude. Here, I'm sick of you trying to think, oh, you're such a tough guy. You're just so anti-establishment. You're this next Stone Cold Steve Austin. Well, guess what? Even if you were all those things, Stone Cold would still kick your ass. That is a fact. <laughs> oh, yeah, like you say you're the next Shawn Michaels, but we all know Shawn Michaels would destroy you in a millisecond because you are not a Shawn Michaels. You'll never be a Shawn Michaels. And that's that. Oh, hmm. So we're just gonna have this little war now. Right? Hmm. You know what?
Punk, you think you're such a hard worker. Who wrestled an Iron Man match? Who wrestled three men in one night? Who did that? Oh, yeah. Me. You didn't do anything. You have done nothing. You are one of the laziest people in this company. Okay, I am the workhorse of this company. I mean, I mean me, Styles... You know, we're the workhorses. You're just there to get a paycheck at this point. You don't even care about the product. Well, yeah, maybe because people actually care about me. They know me. No one knows who you are. Can you sell tickets? I don't think so. Remember your WWE title reign? Yeah, that was a real a real uh, ticket seller, wasn't it? Yeah, like your 434-day title reign was any better when you lost to a part-timer who straight up didn't even come back afterwards. He came back like, what, once? Fought like a six-minute match? And a six-minute, six-second match. Yeah. Well, at least I didn't get injured when I was champion. <laughs> lies! Lies, lies, lies. You were injured when you were champion, Okay. Grant, you still held on to that title because it was a minor injury. My injury was a lot more severe to my knee. And I had to vacate it. Okay? Gentlemen, gentlemen, just stop this petty arguing. If you want to settle your differences, you can just go out to the ring and fight. Okay? Fine. Fine. See you around, punk. I'm going to beat the hell out of him. I'm going to beat him so bad. He's such a prima donna. So, see you, Regal. Well, this can only go one way. So, we're now here at the ring, ladies and gentlemen. This is I, Paul Heyman, with my guest commentary, Mick Foley. We're here on commentary. Seth Rollins is just, you know, going towards the crowd. He's just ignoring Punk. Turned his back on him, which is kind of a terrible thing to do. And oh well, there you go. <laughs> and now Punk's going after all, oh, going after Rollins over here. Oh, these two never really fought in WWE because Rollins got his push, you know, after Punk left. So yeah, I mean, they did. Punk did feud with the Shield, but that was very short term. Punk. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was amazing. Did you see that? We wish we had replays. We don't have that in the budget. But that was incredible. Oh, and just threw him out the ring again. That was amazing. Wasn't it, Mick? <laughs> of course it was. It was awesome. Just the way he bounced from ring to ring. It was what a sight to see. Oh, right on those steps. I mean, those are. It's a pretty painful way to, you know, get thrown down on those stuff. Oh, just right to the, to the, right to the head. Oh, right to the knee. That knee that was busted. Oh, that Seth Rollins had problem, knee problems. And he just threw his knee into it anyway. Punk now is going for like, ooh, a submission on the knee. That's pretty lethal. Yeah. It really is, but oh, Punk, Punk, he thought he had it, but Rollins, Rollins, oh, wait, why is he pulling him backwards? <laughs> hey, Punk, check this out. No way, wait, wait, wait. Oh, 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 gosh. Oh, we all know Punk had that staph infection that could have killed him. Rollins completely exploiting it and just threw him face first into the apron. And just put him towards the um towards the turn towards the corner over there. And Rollins, oh, just uh, just the stiffest kick I've ever seen. Oh, just a nice kick again and a knee. Rollins. No, it's just, oh, this isn't even much of a wrestling match. This is more of, it's a mix of wrestling and street fighting. That's how I would describe it. Oh, and a nice splash. Cover. One, two. Oh, what a kick out by Punk. Punk. Just, and just right to that turnbuckle. 
Punk with the knee. And Rollins fell down. And Punk's about to go for the Bulldog, I believe. The signature move. It's a shame he didn't do it in his later time in WWE. Because it was a good combination. And he just dropped Rollins. With like no regard. Oh, from the top rope. Oh. And the ring canvas just <laughs> collapsed in on itself. Uh, nice slam there, and Punk with an elbow drop to Rollins. Cover. One, two. Oh, but Rollins kicked out again. Oh, oh. Rollins now. Rollins. Rollins. Oh. Oh, nice kick to the outside. Rawls now. Oh, well, that could have gone a lot better. Rawls. Oh, nice bite to Punk's stomach. But Punk going after Rawls' legs again. I'm not sure what this is going to do. This is. Oh. Oh. Oh, the nice elbow again. And Punk, a, a crooked moonsault. But Rollins completely just no-sold that in its entirety. So, was that part of the... I mean, we don't really have a script here. But that clearly wasn't in the final match. But whatever. Oh, it's just... Did you see that? This is straight up shot right to the mouth. Rollins. Rollins. Oh my gosh. Just, just didn't set up for it. He just rammed him right into it. One. Oh, wait. The ropes. Punk's hands under the ropes. Oh, just threw him to the ropes. And he just threw him out. Oh, Rollins to the outside with a bit of, a, I guess you could say, a plancha. Punk. Oh my gosh. Oh, just, just, just stomping him in the back of the head. Okay, this, this isn't, this isn't fun anymore. This is starting to get super unprofessional and just straight up a fight. Oh, to the back. And Punk with Rollins. And he GTSs him. One, two, oh, but Rollins. Rollins with a German. Ooh, that's an interesting maneuver. Oh, like a reverse rock bottom. Oh. Ooh, nice move there. And Rollins now, oh, with like a. Kind of a botched um, shooting star press or botched running su shooting star press. Oh, oh but, but Rollins he got back up immediately after that. Oh, to the back! My God! Oh, he did it again. And Punk, you can just tell he's just not in a good way after that. <sighs> He's put him to the ropes again. Rollins. Oh my gosh. I thought this would be a good match. And it, it is technically. But it's not exactly what I had in mind. Oh. Just dropped him with a DDT. Rollins with a pedigree. It's a punk. Punk's on the turnbuckle. And Rollins. Rollins. Rollins about to go for a curb stop. But... Oh, he hit it. He hit it. And that was a great... And Punk's just... He's just dead.
Rollins one to all. Yes, that was all. Just oh my gosh, Rollins! You're supposed to be professional. You're not supposed to f people fall on their head. What's wrong with you? Oh, completely missed. But Punk. Oh, Punk. He's just had enough of this. Oh. But I don't know what Punk's gonna do now. I think this match is starting to really escalate now. Punk. Oh my gosh. The ring started to completely fall apart on us over here. I mean, we're a bit far away from the action, but we can see it for our monitors. And, oh, Punk's brought in a chair. This is not good. Oh, oh, there's, I mean, there's no real DQs in this, in this league. He's just hitting him in the knees. He's just, oh, just right in the head of a chair. And Punk, one, but his shoulder's up. Punk, what are you doing? Stop! Oh my gosh! Trying to dislocate his his arm. Oh. Well. Oh my gosh! That was the the sickest chair shot I think in the history of this show. I mean, that's just that was just straight up violence. Rollins. He's trying to get Punk in a position. Oh, got him again. I, th I think someone needs to stop this. I think they're about to seriously hurt each other before you know this. Before you know it officially stops. Rollins, what's he doing now? I'm about to ram you in. No. No, I have to stop this. Rollins! Rollins, stop! Stop it! Okay? You got, you've got gone too far. Oh, okay, you've gone way too far, Rollins. You need to stop. Fine, and I'll stop. I'll, I'm leaving. Punk, you, you alright? Let me get this off of you. You alright? Yeah, I'm fine. That Rollins, he's such a punk. He's such a coward. I know. It's a shame he's on this roster. Part of me wishes this roster would be better without him. But just... I'm just hoping you're alright. Oh my gosh! Rollins! What are you doing? Just murdering William Regal with a chair. Oh my... No, it's... Rollins has completely just lost his mind. What's he gonna do with Regal? Oh no, I think I know where this is headed. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, no. No. Oh! Punk, at this point, has had enough. He's had enough of Rollins. And, oh. Oh, well, Punk tried to fall. I don't think he cares about being precise at this point. This is just about pure violence. Oh, just threw him to the ropes again. Oh, just head first. Head first into everything. And just, oh! Right to the ground and punk. Oh, just went went to him. Went across him too. So, folks, that I guess that was it. Kind of disappointing, but you know, Things happen, I guess. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I didn't expect these two to go that far with each other. I mean, they just, I mean, it was started off normally, then they started getting brutal with each other. Oh, it's continuing. Oh, just right into the, um, right into our set over here. Just, oh. Rollins. Rollins is just waiting for Punk to get up. At this point, this match is a no contest. <laughs> this is, I don't think this match is going to end. Punk's up now. 
Rollins, what are you doing at our table? Oh my gosh. That was hardcore. You cannot deny that. I mean, that was insane. But Rollins now, but Punk. Oh! Ooh, that was close. Rollins could have fell. And that would have been bad, obviously. But Punk. Oh, right to the our DVDs over here, part of our set. Oh, oh, Ugh. he's just burying him. Well, punk, get him off me! Get him off me! Get him all off me! You mother... Oh! Oh my gosh! You kicked them off! How do you like that, punk? How do you like that? That felt good? Hope it did. Piece of crap. Yeah, you know what? And you know what? That hurt a little bit, but guess what? I'm still here, you son of a bitch. Oh! This is getting out of control, folks. Oh, he's falling on our table. Punk's putting them... Trying to put them on the table. <sighs> but Punk's now on our... Uh, I guess our ceiling and Punk. No. No, don't. Don't do this. Oh, my gosh. The table didn't even break. Completely no soul that impact. And Punk just fell all the way down, but he's back up now. Alright. So the table didn't want to sell. That's fine. You don't want to sell either. Okay, how about I do something that will end both of our careers? Hmm? Well, how will... You know, will you like that? I think you would. You piece of garbage. Okay. How do I do this? And look at Punk. What is... With, oh! Well, my god. Wow. It's quite the brawl, let me tell you. We need help. We need medical people. We need help for Regal. We need help for these two. They just pretty much try to kill each other. It was more of a shoot fight than anything on this show. So, man, talk about a new era. I mean, we definitely, it's definitely not as family friendly as it once was. But, yeah. I mean, I don't know how Punk's gonna get ready for his, you know, you know, his match, you know, with, you know, Team Angle versus Team Styles, I and mean, so many things are happening at once. It's crazy, but yeah, I mean, thank you. Yeah, I guess we'll just see you in the next episode, folks. And we need we need to cut now because this is serious.